welcome to Theory Dab. Come on in. Thank you. Glad to meet you. What we have here, I'm sure you've looked at the details. We have the four season porch. We take a look around and pan around. This is great for commercial because it is Hamlet zoned. So you can have a nice four season porch here or a retail shop. You've got sidewalk services and you can walk right to all the amenities in Chestertown. Nice little feature. So if you come on with me to the living room. This was built. It's a little vintage styling. It was built in 1947. The dining room, you've got a walk, a kitchen uh, cabinet there. We have uh, amperage services, I think 100 in the house and 100 in the garage. And the dining room, you've got cable connection. 200, excuse me, 200 amp. And 100 in the garage, my correction. And if you follow me to the kitchen, these are fairly newer cabinets with a dishwasher. The husband, a little uh, funny story that the husband and wife argued about the kitchen cabinets. He wanted, uh, she wanted glass, he didn't. So she won a little bit of glass, but he won the, the prize. You've got a nice porch off of the kitchen for summer time. When you got a moment. You can look overlooking uh, Panther Mountain. A lot of nice hiking trails there. Loon Lake is close by. Loon Lake has a public uh, beach. Nice man cave for the garage. There is an awning, uh, one of those uh, sun awnings above here. We've got a, a vintage bathroom, a little bit of painting, but it's cute. And a bedroom on the first level. If you follow me, there's a bedroom on the lower level here. With a, and he's got um, little uh, cabinets or a wall plate so you can get into the plumbing. This would be great for a senior. And there's a little um, electric uh, chairlift for the seniors, for the handicap. Living room here. So you've got your basic, your center colonial type of style with your uh, staircase. And sorry for the mess there, there's a little bit of, uh, for the cable. And we'll head upstairs. And you basically have uh, bedrooms in each quadrant of this upstairs. With a half bath here. Small half bath here. And bedrooms two on each side. You have uh, pull down, you know, added crawl space and more crawl space over at the end. There are bedrooms in each quadrant of the upstairs. If the air will rise, there's no uh, heat vents upstairs. And you've got attic space and more storage space. So you could fit a very large family here. And remember the school is just down the road. It's got sidewalk services. You can walk to all your groceries. Great little Hamlet village. And Loon Lake has a, um, uh, Chestertown has a public uh, beach for their Loon Lake. Loon Lake is 2.23 miles long, kind of shaped like a horseshoe. And you've got a little um, half bath here. That's what this is all for. Like you come on downstairs. She had a yarn shop down there. Um, it's a little rough, but it'll be fine for the entrepreneur to design. What's kind of nice is that she had a uh, handicap chairlift for the seniors. So with the one bedroom upstairs, down the lower level, you've got the uh, nice thing for the handicap. 
you can't use it, I'm sure you could donate it to somebody or um, a nice extra bonus resale. This used to be a yarn shop. It would make a wonderful uh, craft place or renovate it to another uh, business. Again, it's Hamlet Zone, so you could do any kind of side business. Next door is uh, Mountain Abstract. You've got a nice little garage, or not little actually, nice man cave with a garage. If you've got a tinker, you've got an automatic generator transfer, so which is a nice bonus. That's an additional amount. Generator here on the outside that's serviced by Profax. And then we've got the boiler room here. This is the wood and oil boiler on uh, a separate boiler room for, uh, serviced by Buckman Fuel. We'll take you to the garage. The garage has a pole barn section and a little loft upstairs. Her car. She has a right away on both there. sides. Pot belly stove. A nice garage door opener. Uh, insulated. The, the, the husband or the older gentleman used to tinker around in here. So he did a lot of work in here. And then you've got pole barn storage over there and behind as well. This is one of the pole barns. This is the right of way back here. And the other section of the pole barn. Coming back up this way. The pole barn has a metal roof. The house has a shingle, and the shingles are fairly new. Get to that light. And a sign ready to post. Say bye, and we'll do it.